If things seem crowded today at San Diego State University, it's only because they were. A lot of students school officials expected wouldn't be returning this year came back after all. 33,466 was the headcount on this first day of class. That translates into nearly 25,000 full-time students, the school's capacity. The effect of overcrowding was obvious to most students. The problem in the classrooms is that there are more students to take the courses than there are courses to be gotten. There must be hundreds of people crashing Spanish classes. I just wish they had had more classes. Crowded parking lots were easy to find. The school sells more parking stickers than it has spaces. The idea is that there will be a lot of dropouts as the year progresses. This is still the most popular academic spot on campus, the Business Administration Building. Some figures show that more than 40 percent of the students on campus are business majors. In business classes and most others, it was standing room only. But students said teachers were very cooperative in letting them sit in on classes where they weren't registered. Those who wanted to be sure to get a seat could be found waiting in hallways hours before class started. School officials say they expect things will settle down somewhat about three weeks from now when the period to add and drop classes will be over. For some students, that definitely won't be soon enough. Bridget Asaro, News 8, San Diego State. Oh, the humanity. If you don't like crowds, this is not the place for you. But San Diego State is the place nearly 35,000 students have chosen to receive their higher education this fall. That's about 1,000 more than last year. And it's one reason why, starting next year, San Diego State will be closed to community college transfer students before their junior year. But perhaps the most important number here is 11,663. That's how many parking spaces there are on campus. One thing strikes you about San Diego State students right off the bat. A lot of them must be incredible optimists. They actually think they're going to find a parking space out there. It's terrible because I'm working in the commons and I've been here for 25 minutes driving around and I'm late. It's pretty horrendous. This is my first day of school and it's uh, not too easy to find. I'm late for my class right now. But at least he's got a class to go to. State offers 5,400 classes a week, and even that's not enough for this burgeoning student body. Didn't get two of my classes, you know, as usual. Usually you just have to crash on the first day. So that's what I'm waiting for right now, is to crash my classes. Crashing, or sitting in on classes in hopes someone who's actually enrolled will drop out. It's a way of life at San Diego State, and persistence pays off. Everything usually settles down in the parking lots and the classrooms after about two weeks, which still leaves State with its biggest problem. It's a campus that's just too popular. Jody Hammond, News 8, San Diego State.